Actually, I don't have this one. Ooh, 10. What is good everyone welcome back to the retro world guys in today's video we are hitting up an amazing flea market in the dothan alabama area i freaking love going to this flea market i'm hanging out with my buddy jack and we come across a bunch of cool stuff let's go ahead and get into it sadie's flea market in dothan alabama let's go see what they got good morning good morning, good morning. Look at this little Batman, guys. That's kind of sick. Hey, little box of toys. Actually, a couple boxes of toys. Jack's doing a little digging. Looking for those turtles at the bottom. Hey, you just never know. Hey. Yoshi. How much? I don't know how much. Well, that's in the tops. For like a quarter, I'd get it. That other one was a cool. Ma'am, how much are the little, the small figures? Oh. I see some, yes. Yeah, you can have four. But these, uh, right here, like, make them out stuff like that. They're more. They'll be a little more. Okay. I'll see if there's anything else in there. That yeah, actually is cool. One little, one quarter. Oh, little, little Yoshi. Oh, there's a uh, Samurai little. Oh, cool. Hey, what is this little guy? Oh, the Skylanders. I don't have That's a shredder. I, I don't have him. Yeah, so for he's two, yours. If you want it. I, I was gonna say you don't want him? No, I mean I want one of those but complete. Two, like with the with That's the sick. mask. Oh man, new shirt and kind of off cool. off the bat. Alright, so we're at two dollars and twenty five cents. See if there's anything else. What are these little guys up here? Just little figures. Here's a out of here. Like Pokemon cards. Um there's like Joe. Bruce Wayne. That's cool. Yeah. Ma'am, do you have any? Play oh, games. you do. I was going to ask you if you had any video game stuff. I see some back there, actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is, can I go back there and look, or do you want me to wait? Oh, okay. Perfect. Yeah. I'm going to set these guys over here for now. Got a couple in there. Oh, there you got a few more. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Yeah. i look right here. You could get on that table right there and look. I'll put them over there. Yeah, put them over there and look sure. over there. Sure. <laughs> yes, ma'am. How y'all doing? Good. How are you guys doing? All right. Good. Oh, found some more. Thank you. I got a few of these already. So I don't think I need that one. This one looks interesting. Look at that. All right, guys, what we got over here? We got some Pokemon stuff. Look at these little figures. Dang, those are sick. One dollar each or a bag of random for five bucks. Dang, that's sick. How much are those? Oh, they're up there. Dang. Pretty sick to see, though. He's got cards for everything over here. It's crazy. Look at that. Tons of Pokemon cards. Hey, how you doing? Okay. Good. Mind if we look around a little bit? Okay. Cool. Look at the cassettes. Yeah. See what they got. Yeah. See if they got any hip hop in here. Or uh, metal. Or punk. Or punk, yeah. VHS tapes. Ooh, paid up. Nice. Gray. So it must have been like, because it's not the if it, if it had the so. actual cover. Right, right, yeah, yeah. I gave you one a while ago. I forgot yeah. what. I think the Chronic I gave you. That's sick. Yes. Got on. How's it going, man? Hey, good. Good morning. Good morning. Doing good. Right. I was going to say, we took, we took the trip out here today. Oh, that's cool. Some Earthworm Gym. Oh. Oh, what is that? Ooh. Actually, I don't have this one. I don't know what the price is, but oh. probably get maybe. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Dang it! I'd want it loose though. That's the thing. Yeah. 
Well, I think it's all. Oh, it's a common one. Yeah. Um, but it's sick though. Still, I like how they have a companion, like the little companion. Yeah. Oh, that's that is sick. sick. How much are y'all asking on the, the figures? Uh, Earthworm gems are ten. Ten. Okay. Is there any other ones? Or is it just her? It's just her. Just her. Okay. I got you. And then what are the deals on the games? Are they all priced differently? or? Uh, I remember the yard sale deals were like three for ten, so I didn't know if it was still the yeah. same. Or... Yeah, we'll do, yeah, we'll do that. Oh, dude, yeah. what? That's cool. Yeah. Get that one out. Yeah, yeah they're... I got that These are the out. only ones that are more the sealed ones. Oh, okay. That's cool to see. Nice. But yeah, yeah, I'm definitely going to get this. There's a, there's a lot of them that have never... Okay. Yeah, no. I'll definitely look through and see. I got that one. There was a game I was looking at the other day. I can't see, I can't see Which one? Hey, this one here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, here you go. He had. Uh, Brian see, that's had random, but cool. Yeah. Brian had an Earthworm Jim prototype. Oh, really? Oh, really? That's prototype? Cool. Dang. Yeah, so that's crazy. That to, uh, nice, oh, really? man. 3,200. Dang. Oh wow! I believe it. Though. Yeah, I was gonna say stuff like that for sure. Yeah, that's cool. Oh, that's sick. Huh. Unproduced too, so that's like, oh, dude, I'm not trying to take all this stuff. But that's like crazy. It's like there going on. That's awesome. Dude. Yeah, they got a. Dude, I didn't know they all had like little. Uh, yeah, all of them have like companions. Oh yeah. I, I didn't. I didn't realize that either. Because remember I said after the Ghostbusters ones yeah. I got, I kind of want more of those little figures yeah. to put in the Ninja Turtle ones. Right. So, like, I kind of want more of those. Right? Yeah, are the yeah. loose games so cool. the same 3 for yeah. 10, or are they cheaper? Yeah, they're cheap. They're, they're, cheap. Oh, they're, they're two of these. That's awesome. 3 for 5. That, and that makes 3 for 5? All right. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. You got me on 3 for 5. Yeah. That's awesome. Because there's a few in here I was looking at, and I was like, but they're loose, but it's like 3 for 5. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's how this game goes. Another baby on the way. Oh, yeah. So, so. Yeah. I don't want to let you go. Yeah, I, don't let see you right. there. I haven't even yeah. cleaned yeah, or checked like these, but if yeah, you're looking through this, PS2. Oh, okay. I, like a hand I already found two. Maybe you'll find uh, more in here. Nintendo 64 and GameCube and stuff. Right. I don't want to sell them. Yeah. <laughs> Try to keep that if possible, right? But might not come to that. Man, that one's kind of scratched. <laughs> Three for five. If, uh, if I'm taking too long and you oh, want to really? kind of look around, no, go no, for it. Okay. Like Oh, nice. I brought this one out Yeah. Those, I mean, those do look awesome. Uh, I, uh, this was, I, I, I bought this out here that was broken. Mm -hmm. the screen was broken. Thank you for letting me look at those. I appreciate that. Oh. Here we go. Found three. I just feel like it's good to know if you find something that's broken. You put your loose ones in here. Just okay. Give it, oh, yeah. Oh, give a little protection. I gotcha. Hey, I appreciate that. You too, man. Would you guys do maybe eight on one of these? Yeah, I'm good for you. Done. <laughs> so we got those two guys now. We'll put those over there. I'm going to see if there's any other games. You guys always got the best stuff. You see all this shadow stuff? Did you ever like pay, like like see these grow? I never saw them so growing as up. As a kid, I had this one. It's funny you say that because every time we see it as a toy store, as a kid, I had this exact one. Yeah, and he has sick. a... a yeah, these are kind of cool, too. Okay. Those are cool. I never saw those. Yeah. The, all this and that, dude. That Just seeing it, that, that. That's what I was telling you about. They had that at the yard sale, too. I got this exact one for, I guess, Christmas or something. That's so sick. So I do remember that specifically. But that was the only one I Heck had. Heck, yeah. Guys, like, oh, I got some Simpsons. Yeah. <laughs> Dang. That's sick. He just, I don't know. He just had that look. Uh, I, would, I would ask him how much. How much... How much do you have on the Simpsons? Uh, 30 bucks for the pair. 30 for the pair? Okay, appreciate it. Guys, we are looking for cool stuff. What do we got down here? Hmm, that's kind of cool. Oh, that has definitely seen better days, but still. Kind of cool to see. What is this? It looks like someone maybe just painted it. I think, yeah. It's kind of sick, though. What year, though? That'd be a cool little collectible. How much are they asking? Okay. They got a little price tag. Ten bucks. Ten. I mean, it's probably more or less what it's worth. If you want it, it's I not know. something <laughs> I care to get. A little Nickelodeon magnet. That's what I grew up watching. Yeah. yeah, that thing. I bet that's forty-something years old. Oh, that thing is awesome. 
Yeah, I'll definitely get that for 50 cents. A little, I don't know what he is, actually. Look at this little guy. <laughs> I, think he, I think he might be Build-A-Bear. Build -Bear. Yeah, no, it's not. Oh, look, it's actually, it's actually branded. Leonardo, like, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Fuzzy Bear, I didn't know they, I didn't know they made those. Guys, you just gotta dig, man. You just don't know. That's Jurassic World. Or no, Jurassic, oh. Jurassic Park, actually. Oh, sick. I'm just trying to see, I think it's the third movie. I mean, you should definitely get that for your collection. Maybe you'll find a couple others. How you doing today? All right. That's all three for a dollar. Three for a dollar? Three for a dollar? Yeah. Oh, it's not? It's the exact mold, though. So somebody really? ripped it off. <laughs> Oh, okay. Which is crazy. We thought it was from Jurassic Park. It looks like it, though. It's pretty no, cool. It, that's the exact mold from the movie. All right, guys. We got some games over here. Let's see what we got. That's ah, actually a decent one. Ah, it's not bad for 10. All right, guys. Ah, just kind of looking, seeing what you got. All right. Got some NES games. Pretty cool. Any other video game stuff or just these right now? Yeah. Oh, you got some more? Okay. Yeah. I always thought I was playing that I haven't sold any for a while. Oh, uh, okay. But yeah. Did, uh, did you used to set up in Panama City a long time ago? Yes. We, we used to come to your booth all the time. Yeah. Were you the Transformer guy? Uh, kind of like Mario and stuff. I remember oh, okay. I bought this big Donkey Kong off you a long time oh, yeah. ago. I remember the big Donkey Kong. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to look in here and see what you got. Appreciate you showing me, man. No uh, problem. Hey, Mario Kart's in there. 20. Mm. For twenty now. Here's a walking dead figure. <laughs> hey, check this out. That's a Mortal Kombat, which is kind of crazy. What? Yeah, I've never seen I didn't know they. What is this from? I mean, they, they, they had yeah. G.I. Joe looking figures, right? They, they, they had G.I. Joe ones. They also had some that were slightly bigger than Joe's. Oh, it made me. That's actually kind of sick. How much are you asking on that? Four. Four bucks? I might do it. I'm, I'll keep looking, see if there's anything else. All right, you said two for this guy. Yeah. You said you would do one on him? Yeah. Be in the McDonald's store. Oh, these are some of the newer ones, aren't they? Yeah. Okay. The other new one didn't make it. I gotcha. Anymore. Uh, I had a bag of stuff that needed to come and it didn't come. Yeah. This is cool, man. Oh. Vintage. Um, oh, that's cool. I think that's one of the old Hardy's ones. Oh, uh, yeah, 2015. That's oh, pretty cool. I thought older than that. <laughs> hey, well, now 2015 is kind of old, which is crazy to think about. <laughs> mm hmm. Yeah, all right. I'm going to get these off you. I'm going to get that bike, too. Where was it? The little Mortal Kombat oh, bike? Oh, it was right here. I never got around to seeing what year it was, but... Probably 90s, like you said. Oh, I know it's 90s, because I was looking it up, but... It's... So we're at two, three, four. We're at eight bucks so far. Mm -hmm. Put that there. That's cool. 1992 Hasbro Pod Tucket Black, blah, okay. blah, blah. All right. Yeah, I'll definitely do that. You see anything in there for two? Is, if a Batman had a cape, I would definitely get it, but he doesn't. Okay. So oh, yeah. The Batman had a but cape. But it's a really good, you know, for what uh, it is, the, the I, chest I, I, is a mess. I'll go buck on that one. Hey, there you go. It, it's it's a good deal, but he, he wants it complete, though, so. Oh, we'll yeah. Hey, dang, dude. But that is a really good deal. He's got a lot of stuff. Dude, just like the, the old days. Yeah, that's Venom. Oh, sick! Eddie Rock Venom, so that's cool. There's a lot of Batman and stuff in here. You probably want to look yeah. just to make sure. Add them to the pile. I don't know if you have this Terminator either. There's this. Do you have that one? No, he I don't. He doesn't have the... There's a front that goes on him, but he, he, that's still sick. I would I would just play it like that if I had him. He's kind of cool. I'm just showing I might you. pass just because I already have a few of them now. And yeah. I'd rather have them like with, yeah, yeah, with the I thing. I think I'm good on the, I'm good on the Batman there. though, but there it is sick to see. Okay. I thought this was what's his name from uh. Oh, uh, dude, it's all good. Toys R Us. I always I used to carry on the chest. Hey guys, look at all this stuff. He's got transformers. Okay. He's got everything here. Look, like he's old Thomas the Train Engine. <laughs> Pepsi Poker Chip. Kind of cool. Hey man, <laughs> we had more. <laughs> See anything in there? Mm, just cheap ones, I think. A little, well, no, really yeah, I was gonna know, say because but... they, they fall to the bottom usually. Guys, we got some games here. Pretty good, man. All the games are they just priced differently? Uh, uh, 
Okay. Oh, inside the box. Okay. Inside, like open up, you're saying? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, I got gotcha. you. Eight, two for, okay. This is what you're talking about. You said, oh, okay, eight bucks each. Not really looking for Xbox stuff right now. Is there more on the other side? Yeah, Oh, okay. PS4, nice. Is there anything in here, guys, for eight bucks that we're after? Kung Fu Rider. Hey, guys, these are only five bucks each. Now, that is a little bit more of my speed. Hey, wait a second. What do we got here? Let's see. Invi what? I've never even heard of that one. I don't know if these are five bucks each, but. You don't know, we gotta look through. Tons of other stuff down here. Lethal Alliance. Little scratch. I don't know how to bring back PSP games. I've never seen that one though. It could be, could be something to look up. Alright, guys. Dang. I'll look through some of these when I stop recording. <laughs> Alright guys, we got some He-Man here and woo! Ten. Uh, I think this is not legit. Don't know. Dude, I can't tell if this because they make uh they make bootlegs of these now. Right. If this is legit though, that's an insane deal. <clears throat> How's that? I think, oh, you know what, is it sealed? Does it? Yeah. Back at the house, let's take an up close look at everything that we just picked up. All right, guys, we got a little bit of everything. The flea market was freaking amazing. Shout outs to Dothan, definitely plan on coming back. Now, these two things right here, what we're gonna talk about first, I didn't get footage of. I want to say these came from the same vendor as da -na -na -na. you guys definitely saw this at the end and I am sorry the footage cut off. I think that's when I put my phone down and I wanted to open it up to make sure it was legit because at the beginning I thought it was kind of one of those bootlegs. Upon further inspection, I think it's the real deal. Y'all drop some comments and let me know. But guys, let's go ahead and get into these. These were only three bucks each. I do love Motu. This is kind of like the newer toys they've made, but for $3, I figured why not? You can tell the packaging is already open. I figured we'd just go ahead and rip these open and check them out. I don't know if we'll do that in a video on this channel, but we've got He-Man Power Attack, so. Pretty cool for three bucks, put that over there. And then we have another awesome character right here from the same line, we've got Trapjaw. So very cool, one of my favorite characters in the Motu universe, I do love Trapjaw. Just his design, just everything about him, I don't know, I just always thought he was kind of sick. So very cool there. We'll talk about this here in a little bit. Let's talk about some of this other stuff, guys. Not really in any particular order. We've got Yoshi right here. I think he is the 2.5 inch uh, Yoshi, if I'm not mistaken, probably from Jack's Toys. Let's see if it says, usually it does say it down on the bottom. Can't really read that right now, but either way, we got Yoshi. I don't think we have this particular Yoshi, so we're gonna add him to the Nintendo shelf. And kind of the same story for this as well. We got this Donkey Kong. I'm not sure what year this guy is from. It does say Jack's, but man, the detail on this thing is awesome. So very, very cool. Super stoked to be adding this to the growing Nintendo collection as well. We'll put it back there. And he's not going to stand. That's okay. We've got another Donkey Kong. I think this was like a McDonald's toy. It definitely feels like a McDonald's toy. So I don't know. Oh, I was going to say, I don't know what he does. Here comes the punch. Oh, take that venom. <laughs> so very, very cool stuff there. Oh yeah. Like I said, completely out of order. Guys, we saw this magnet nick time nestle quick time from nickelodeon magazine guys this thing is from 1994 and it is going to look beautiful 
on the fridge. Let's go have a snack. Just kidding. We're going to put that there for now. Guys, okay. We were talking about some He-Man stuff, some Master stuff. We got Orko. I think this might have been like a, what, a Burger King toy? Oh, no, McDonald's. So 2003 McDonald's toy. It's crazy. 2003 now at this point is, what, almost 20 years old? Oh, man, that's kind of nuts. Let's see uh, Let's see what he does real quick. All right, guys, got him all wound it up. Let's see what he does. Wow, he's broken. Oh, nah, he's kind of working. Well, I mean, his feet work, but <laughs> why doesn't he work? I guess you gotta hold his little hand almost. All right, well, let's put this over here and hopefully that turns off soon because that's gonna be kind of annoying. You better be quiet. All right, guys, over here. As Jack pointed out, we've got Eddie Brock. We've got Venom. This is sick. We do not have this one. I think this is 90s. Let's see. He just looks 90s. Yep, 1995 Toy Biz. Don't know if he's actually gonna stand up a lot of these figures over time. Get those wobbly legs. Oh no, he's standing up just fine. Look out angry he is we are venom <laughs> oh i have too much fun playing with these action figures shout out to jack you guys probably heard me every time he finds something sick i'm like dude do you want that like because most of the time he's just stoked to find stuff and he usually passes it over to me there is some stuff that he comes across he's like oh no i'm keeping that but a lot of the times he's just like no this is sick i don't need this i'm not looking for this right now so you have it so shout out to you jack appreciate you buddy that is super sick and guys Oh, yeah. We've got Raphael. He was, what, two? Yeah, two bucks, 1993. I forget the series he's from. Was this from the movie Turtles? Was this from something else? I think it was the, the third movie, TMNT3, which, let's go ahead and face it, guys, is the worst out of the three. I enjoy, like, the first 30 minutes of that movie, and then I don't know what happens, but it just goes downhill. <laughs> it just becomes, like dang like it seems promising at the beginning and then it's just like nah <laughs> not promising anymore but yeah this is sick little by little i have mentioned it i am trying i don't know exactly how many we're gonna actually end up checking off the list but i am trying to complete well i don't want to say all of the tmnt vintage lines because there's a bunch i'm definitely trying to complete a good amount of them so if we come across a figure we don't have whether it's a turtle whether it's one of the other good guys whether it's one of the villains we go ahead and pick it up especially if it's cheap and then we check it off the list so very very stoked on that just wanted to show y'all real quick we got the new turtle sitting on the turtle shelf and guys, this is kind of what it's looking like right now. We actually have two turtle shelves, but just wanted to show y'all. It's coming along pretty nice. And we have these little cardboard cutouts for the back. And I thought those look pretty sick. So, yeah. And guys, we have another, I think, McDonald's toy. We got little Mario popping out. I don't know if he's supposed to, like, hold down and then it's me. But no, this one is from 2002 on the bottom. So this is cool, guys. They keep coming out with these like McDonald's Mario toys like every year now. I'm not going after all of them the second they come out. But usually stuff like this trickles down to flea markets, yard sales, and you end up finding them super cheap. So I don't remember what we spent, but it was not that much money. So that's always nice. Guys, something I didn't even know existed. Look at this. We got Mortal Kombat but it's like this cool little vehicle bike thing. I don't know, maybe this is supposed to pull back and like do something. Well, oh yeah. Oh, hey, it works still. It's kind of hard to do one-handed. Ah, uh, who's he gonna get? Who's he gonna get? Bam! Dang, it didn't work. <laughs> so yeah, Mortal Kombat, not sure what year this is. I think it's got to be 90s usually the year is hidden somewhere and i always find it after i get done recording for some reason but this is really cool i just love coming across weird stuff like this especially for toy lines i didn't even know anything about of course they've made mortal kombat toys over the years but it's not really a toy line i've been going after now that we've got this bike right here i don't know we might have to start going after it i don't think this is gonna work Oh, it kind of works. Yeah, definitely going to keep my eye out for future Mortal Kombat stuff, I think. 
And oh yeah, let's talk about this. So speaking of toy lines, guys, it's just gotten out of hand. Don't start collecting toys because it's the same thing that happened with me in video games. I was like, oh, I need, I need some, I need some PS2 stuff. Uh oh, oh, I need some Wii stuff. Uh oh, I need some N64 stuff. Like, and then it just it spirals out of control. It's the same thing that's happened with toys. Now we're going for TMNT stuff. We've been going for Mario stuff, so that's not really that unheard of. Master stuff kind of started trickling in. Uh, toy biz stuff as well, little by little. And then, guys, another toy line is the Earthworm Jim toy line. Another toy line from the 90s. And the show was actually pretty good. I didn't get to finish it, but I did find a few episodes online. It was like seven or eight episodes of the actual cartoon. It was really good. And, of course, y'all know the games. Difficult, but very fun. Guys, we have Princess What's Her Name earthworm jim's main squeeze or so he thinks i just love how funny this is look at this a worm with an attitude and a really big gun <laughs> so sick now this might be something we would probably open i know guys keep it on card but come on this isn't like a rare figure it's different right like let's say this guy was on card yeah, this one is going to be worth a lot more. Opening them up is going to instantly just ruin the value. Doesn't really make sense. But something like this, they were, they were selling them for what? They were 8 to $10 a piece. They had like 10 of them. I don't know what the value is of this. I'll throw it up on the screen. But this thing probably on card probably is not worth much more than like 15 bucks. So maybe I should have grabbed a second one. One to keep sealed, one to open. I don't know. But I think you guys might see this in a future unboxing. This is pretty sick. Jack was talking about the little companion here. He said he's always a sucker for like these little companions. They always just throw in these vintage toy lines. And I do think they're pretty sick. So you got the accessories. You got her looking awesome. And it does show the other ones on the back as well. And of course, Playmates made these. It seems like a lot of the sick toy lines from back then were made by Playmates. They did the TMNT ones and a bunch of others. But look at this, guys. We definitely need an Earthworm Gym at some point. Oh, this one's sick too with the special deep sea mission suit. Battle damage Earthworm Gym. The monstrous Peter Puppy. We actually saw this at a toy store. That might be in a video y'all have not seen yet, but I think it was like 20 or 30 bucks it was sick i thought about getting it i ended up passing we have this one though we have henchrat we don't have the evil cat but we do have henchrat we found this guy funny enough we found this guy also at another flea market so now we have two out of however many figures in the earthworm gym line both found at flea markets for pretty good deals y'all might see this one in an unboxing y'all let me know if i should rip it open y'all let me know if i should just hoard it and put it in the closet and just uh, no one will ever see it I don't know. Guys, let's talk about some other stuff we picked up. We picked up a couple of loose games. All right, first up, we've got this game called Legend of the Dragon. I keep seeing this name, and I think because I'm thinking of Legend of Dragoon on PS1, it just suckered me in. Is this game going to be any good? I don't know. It could probably be horrible, but we will definitely give it a try. It's a loose game. No big deal. Next up, we have SmackDown versus Raw 2007. Another loose game, but guys, these were so cheap. I don't remember exactly exactly once again how much they were but when you see cheap loose games like this just go ahead and pick them up why not and we have pac-man world 3 i actually have not played this one yet and i know the pac-man world games are pretty fun so that is pretty awesome as well guys oh buddy we've got nickelodeon ah real monsters what are the odds what are the odds of finding two nice like nickelodeon collectibles here well, obviously it's a game too but just the fact that we found two things from nickelodeon i think that is pretty awesome i don't really see a lot of nickelodeon stuff i grew up watching nickelodeon cartoon network i would love to come across more let me keep smacking the magnet but yeah this is sick i don't know if this game came out on other consoles kind of hoping it was just a genesis exclusive because i'm just trying to go for exclusive stuff on the genesis if they had it on nintendo i'll probably just get the nintendo version but this is cool picked it up anyways i thought it was awesome and then guys we got a couple more games here we have soul caliber 2 it is loose but it is for the nintendo gamecube and then we do have ssx i don't have this one on the ps2 i think we have ssx three if i'm not mistaken or maybe two i don't know which one we have but i'm almost positive we don't have this one so very very cool guys overall an amazing day at the flea market but we're not done just a quick look at this guys we have the nintendo classic edition it was ten dollars y'all are seeing the price on here when you see a price like this you do not have to haggle okay you're not gonna be like huh, will you take nine like no 
<laughs> just pay the freaking ten dollars we all know this is worth more now here's where this could bite me in the butt i pay 10 bucks and then it turns out this is like a bootleg then it's like well i should should have got it for nine but i think this is legit we're gonna look at it real quick now i know it was missing something i don't know what it was missing let's see does that have the controller i mean the controller looks legit it's got nintendo on there does it yeah nintendo on the back I mean, I think it's real, guys. I think we got a really good deal on this. Oh, and what's funny is, look. Oh, you know what? I could have swore. I didn't realize this came with the NES Classic. I thought they had an old school poster in here. Because when I was first looking at this, I was like, oh, that's kind of cool. But no, like Nintendo actually made like an old school looking poster. That's sick. Okay, I didn't know that at all. That's really awesome. This is a really sick poster. So, very cool there. And, guys, we got the console. I think, yeah, no power cable. But, I mean, I don't know. This right here is what threw me off. I saw this, and I was like, I don't know if that's supposed to look like that. But I think it is. So, I don't know, guys. Y'all let me know. Is this legit? I mean, it looks legit. I, can't, I, I plug it in, and then it has, like, freaking... <laughs> I don't know what game <laughs> some like barbie game booted up or it's like the the freaking arby's like commercial or something is on there i don't know we'll find out at some point but either way i mean the box and the poster for 10 bucks some might argue those might be worth it alone guys a very sick freaking day all right everyone that is going to be it for today's episode i appreciate all of the support drop some comments and let me know what your favorite thing was that you saw in today's video if you want to see more video game hunting episodes make sure to check out the playlist if you want to see more just straight up toy hunting stuff make sure to check out the playlist for that too i appreciate all of y'all make sure to also hit that subscribe button if you are new here and you want to watch weekly videos here at the retro world guys until next time peace